These videos on social media show the aftermath of an explosion at Ukraine's Novokakovka Dam. Water can be seen pouring through the breach at an alarming rate. President Volodymyr Zelensky condemned the destruction, calling it an act of terrorism caused by Russian forces, which he's vowed to push out of Ukraine. The dam has been in Russian control since shortly after the invasion. Moscow-backed regional administrators have denied responsibility, instead blaming Ukrainian shelling for the damage. Ukrainian officials say at least 80 towns are in danger and that evacuation orders have been issued for people living downstream. In five hours, the water will reach critical level. All services are working, emergency service, police, military, all together. I urge you to take documents and essentials and wait for evacuation buses. Footage filmed by Ukraine's public broadcaster showed that flooding had already begun in the Korbel district of Kherson. The Soviet-era dam straddling the Dnipro River was strategically important, supplying water to the Crimean Peninsula, while its reservoir helped the cooling system at the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant. The IAEA issued a statement saying there was no immediate danger at the plant. Back in Kyiv, President Zelensky convened an emergency security council after warning last fall that Russia was plotting such an act and that it would be a large-scale disaster.